Before we dive into the exciting features, let's make sure your account is up to date. To do that, we'll head over to the settings, which you can find right here in the navigation bar. Once you're there, you'll be greeted with a few options to explore. But first, let's take a look at how you can log out of your account when you're done with your session. It's always good to know how to wrap things up neatly, right? Now let's focus on the star of the show. My profile. This is where you can really personalize your booking page. Upload an image that represents you, so when others are booking with you, they can easily recognize your identity. But that's not all. You can also add a description to your booking page. Get creative and write anything you like. In this example, I've added my role in company, but you can share anything that showcases your uniqueness and relevant for the type of meetings you require. Next up, we have the option to set your business name. This is what will be displayed on your booking page. Choose your professional name or use your company name. It's completely up to you. Oh, and don't forget about time zones. You can easily edit the time zone of your account, which will ensure that others see your availability correctly, no matter where they are in the world. It's all about making scheduling a breeze. Moving right along, let's explore the email reminders section. Here, you have the power to control those automatic notifications that go out to your clients and yourself via email. You can turn them on or off as you prefer. Now, let's head over to Accounts and Billing. This is where you can update crucial information about your account such as your password, full name, and the email address you signed up with. It's always good to keep your details current. If you click on the next area, you'll find all your subscription info. You can easily see when you joined, how many seats are associated with your account, and if needed, add or delete seats. Plus, you have the convenience of managing your card details and subscription right here. So, that's a rundown of the settings in CatchApp. It's essential to have everything set up just the way you like it. Now that you're familiar with these options, you're ready to make the most of your catch-up experience. Let's get started.